Hi, and welcome back to Journey, where we explore this weird place. Wow, what is that even? Weird evil stuff here. Our friend is crying out over there, so we should go that way to see if we can help him. Boss battle here now. No. He just went away. Okay. I was a bit uh, surprised by there being gameplay all of a sudden. Don't get me wrong, I think this exploration thing without any deeper gameplay mechanics is perfectly fine for exploration game. I really like it. Okay, so... This thing is evil, yeah? Yep. Important meat wanted to show me that it is evil, wanted to reinforce that, but not have any gameplay about that yet. Okay. My scarf energy is empty. Would be nice to have a sprint for that occasion, but okay. We're going on here. I mean, what should happen? Why am I? Why am I hiding? They're doing well with giving it an eerie atmosphere and something that feels like there's danger. And also this perfect timing to give you this where every player would instinctively go. Yeah, and once I leave it, he's going away to not have a real danger there. Maybe there's just an achievement like get by undetected. This is a very eerie part. The green lighting this. It's best to make it more eerie. We are carrying a very long scarf now. I assume we will have a sort of boss fight and lose it all, or something like that. here and landed in the perfect place. We found everything here. And we're done with the dark world.
Yes, and it swept over the city. We saw that already. And the people are buried beneath, between, below the ground. We didn't see that. And this looks like the beginning of the game. And there we are. In the desert that's above the city. The gate opens. Double doors. Eerie. We got some scar float back. But we're not going to be using that now. Because we get a level transition in a moment. Yeah. And the loading screen will forget, <laughs> will uh, not forget how, how long my scarf is. Okay. I assume as we have descended, we must ascend now to that hole above. Okay. Following the lights is our only clue, our only clue right now. So we're going towards the lights. desert in the mirror and now this room is filled with floating juice yeah okay we see our next target to reach that up there do we need to go around I think we can need to go around because we can only reach so much height from one of these yeah basically need to go from one to another First, activate that mural over there. Last one showed me in the desert. Second one showed me in another place. Now we get our tentacle friends now. Ah, these are the, the big scarves. Big scarves flying around in a place where there's a sand waterfall, and we were there. That's basically what it says. And there's basically nothing here. So let's check you. Let's look around. 
Nothing to see. Might get more upgrades in this room. Like over there. But how would we get there? This is basically my best guess. side content thingy need to get back to where we started <sighs> music is good the mural is. It's me again with a longer scarf and the rest we'll see in a moment. There's something really big with a really big really big scarves around in the city it shows us. with you my friend okay we have been there we need to go there we're making the scarf longer The mirror shows me again going upstairs. Ah, oh, we get bridges now. Elevators and bridges. these bridges reload my stuff yeah still looking around getting getting sure that we are missing anything but I assume we are to get over there that was close my idea of jumping came a bit late I almost missed the ledge and another mural of me going down like pyramid stairs oh now I are uh, now I see what's happening it's something retracting to the top inside that oh this is a cylinder going down no, I'm not sure at all. Uh, are they, those no? Uh, those are not all on the top, so I can look at them if I want to. Okay. And we can go... We missed one collectible. Whatever. 
go forward to the next level, please. The sun is speaking to me. Or are we sucking in wisdom from the room? Yeah, all the lights were made out of runes. Yeah. So our big friend is showing us the wisdom that we need to ascend to the mountain top. Okay, this is showing me now all the scarf things on the broken aqueduct that we ascended. Then the scarves flying around and we're descending steps through the city to the underground where the evil scarves are. And then back up this tower until we now go against the wind to climb the mountain. And if we turn around we go down the mountain and end up in the desert. There we are. And we must ascend the mountain. And the door opens. What a visual. Also I like the visuals of, of our main character with the red hood and rope and the golden embroidery on it and the glowing signs. Really looks nice. I like the art style. in frozen land okay we're getting control our rumble oh a friend fell down oh no my scarf gets my scarf is getting shorter help help friends okay we need our scarf friends to help me. Because the temperature will have me stop dead in my tracks. There's an evil one again. Can I please have my camera control back? I like it better when I have camera control. Thank you. Could you please slide? Nope. Oh no. Too much control of my friend. Too much control around the friend game. Ah, okay. So we have really deep, deep freezing storm every now and then. So we have to hide behind these pillars. It will it will deep freeze our scar friends again.
Okay, we get the controller warning. Uh, I remember there's a warning. Well before the storm arrives. I assume uh, from what uh, the pauses were between the last two. But that we can get to that one over there. I assume we will be blown back if we don't make it to one of those in time. Because this doesn't strike me as a game that has that really has enemies. Hey, let's go through this gate then. We only get little ones and and uh, continuous controller rumble. There's friend. Friend is hiding because he won't. He is freezing. Go back into your hiding, friend. You no, know, don't need to do this. You were shiming at me, what were you, are you doing? Come on out, friend. We need to give warmth to each other. He's a bit shy. Big evil guy is coming. Controller armor is crazy here. I would like it if it were less, but some games just need to go haywire on that. Let's take shelter over there and then cross to the other side in a moment. I assume we can take shelter here. Yep. Yeah. This leads us to a mural. Mural of big carpets fighting each other. Okay, this warms me again, so that will give me the the power to go across this chasm if the controller rumble stops any time. <laughs> uh oh. Okay, no need for the warm place because uh, that's not how this world works. Okay, uh, we're going up and we will be going past this corner in the next episode. See you tomorrow, have a nice day.